Hi, I'm Dr. Yang Yang with the Washington Regional Electrophysiology Clinic, part of the Walker Heart Institute. For patients with heart failure, a lot of the times their heart beats desynchronously, they're disorganized. The left side and the right side are not beating together. A pacemaker can help these patients by making the heart beat in sync. We put the pacemaker on the left side of the chest. There's a vein that goes from the arm under the collarbone into the heart. We put the leads through that vein into the heart. One will go on the right side of the heart and that paces the right side. And the left bundle lead will go in a special area called the left bundle branch area. And that uses your electrical conduction system of the heart to but the most naturally pace the heart. People who can benefit the most from left bundle branch area pacing are those with heart failure who are on all the right medications, who still have a low heart function, who still feel very poorly even on the medications with a desynchronous heartbeat. Recovery wise for the procedure is a one night stay in the hospital. We double check to make sure the pacemaker is working well and we send you on your way. It is one week of keeping the incision dry and clean and two weeks of making sure the arm does not go above the head. And over time, over the next months, we expect you to start to feel better for once the heart starts beating in synchrony, for you to start walking more, feeling less shortness of breath, and for the heart function to improve gradually. Everyone's health condition is unique. And in order to find out of whether you're a candidate, that's a discussion that you need to have with your doctor. To learn more, contact us at the Washington Regional Electrophysiology Clinic.